Hello everyone, in today's video I'll show you an application that is on all Android phones and tracks what you do on your phone and also listens to what you are saying. Since the application runs in the background, it drains your phone's battery faster and slows it down. In today's video I'll show you where to find this application and how to disable it. Let's dive in. The main problem is that this application monitors everything that we write on our keyboard. Or if you use voice input, it also listens to what you say. It also monitors who write what to us and all this in order to offer us ready-made words. Now I'll show you a universal way on every phone how to find this application. Open Play Store on your phone. After this, in the upper right-hand corner of the screen, tap on your profile photo. Then scroll all the way down and tap on help as feedback. After this type here delete, type word delete, delete and you can find delete apps on your Android device, tap on that. After this in the section delete apps that you installed, tap on tap to go to application settings, tap on that. And here you can see all your applications, then tap on search and type word Android. Android and you can find application Android System Intelligence. This application is responsible for the so-called smart functions of the phone. There are not the main functions, but additional ones. For instance, if uh, music is playing nearby, a notification about the artist will appear. But for this, the application must have constant access to the microphone. Or, when you write an SMS, this application will offer you ready-made words. To guess which words to offer, it must monitor your entire correspondence. Another feature of this application can suggest an app you need. However, for this, Android system intelligence must monitor your previous actions. So, if you turn off this application, you will not notice any big difference in using your phone. To collect information about us, this app has many permissions. If we tap on permissions, we can see that uh, Android System Intelligence has access to call logs, contacts, location, microphone, nearby devices, notifications, phone, SMS, and if we tap in upper right hand corner of the screen on three dots and then tap all permissions, we can see that this app also has access to uh, read call log take pictures and videos, read your contacts, access to location, record audio, connect to Bluetooth, show notifications, read our text messages, SMS or MMS. Although the manufacturer said that none of our data is sent to them, for your peace of mind and better privacy, I recommend first clearing the data this application has already collected about us. In the upper left hand corner of the screen tap back, after this tap back again, then scroll all the way down and tap on storage. And here tap on clear cache and clear data. Select all time and tap clear data. And after this disable this application, tap back and here you can see button disable tap on that and tap disable app. However, if you don't want to turn off this application completely, you can only limit the tracking of this application. For instance, if you want to leave these smart features on your phone, then tap Enable. After this, go to main settings of your phone. Scroll down a little bit to security and privacy. Then scroll all the way down and tap on more privacy settings. Scroll all the way down again. And after this tap on Android System Intelligence. First tap on Clear Data, then select All Time and tap Clear Data. After this tap on Android System Intelligence again, tap on Keyboard and turn off the switch next to Show Smart Text Suggestion. Turn this off. On some phones it uh, looks a little different, so I'll show you it on another phone. On another phone head to main settings. After this scroll all the way down and tap on privacy. Then tap on Android system intelligence 
and here you can see clear data, tap on that, after this select all time and tap clear data. Tap on Android system intelligence again, tap on keyboard and turn off this switch. That's all I wanted to share in this video. If it was helpful, please like, subscribe and hit the bell to not miss new helpful videos. You can also support the development of the channel by following the link in the description of this video. I will be very grateful and you will get access to bonuses such as priority responses to comments, contact via Facebook and exclusive videos. Thank you for watching.